Kaiser. Hello everyone. Thanks for watching this video. I'm gonna show you how to upgrade the H9 6 TV box with RK322 line chip. And the first step is you're gonna have to prepare the USB cable. You can see this cable is not a normal USB cable. Both fronts of the cable is USB 2.0 or USB 3.0. And you need to prepare a chopstick or something naked. And then the second step, you're gonna install, click the folder, install the driver assistant. You can see it. And then you double click the driver install file. And you can see this dialog. It means you're gonna, right now you need to install it. Remember, the left bottom is to install the driver. Double click it, okay, and then choose this one. Okay, after this dialog shows, it means you install the driver successfully. Okay, and you close it. And you open another, and then you open the factory tool folder, factory tool. And you double click the factory tool, Open it. And then you can choose this one, click this one to choose the language. The second language is English. Okay. After you enter this dialog, you click the firmware. And then you choose the RK322 line image file. This is the image file. You can see it, you can find it in your folder. Okay, you wait. Right now it's loading. Okay. It means it loads, it loads the file successfully and you click the wrong button. Okay, so it's ready now. The fourth step, you need to uh, plug to your TV box with this cable to, to the computer. You plug this USB cable to the USB-4 port, put inside it, and then plug this port into your computer. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right now, you use the chopstick or something like it to insert the TV port, and there is a button inside of it. You insert it, you press the button, and you hold it. And then you can see there is downloading file shows on the, on the window. So right at this moment, all you have to do is to, is to wait. You're gonna have to wait a few minutes. Right now it's downloading the firmware and it's almost finished. So after you downloading the firmware, it's checking the firmware.
，然后我同意了，然后买一个地点，修改这个分原因，一一改个分辨率，也是不符。什么都没提供，平台马上判定。<笑>全跟我之前那个也是一样，看什么没听出来，全额退款。我觉得上周分都是不一样，不一致的，他们的那个判决原则。然后我马上就给他统一做一个退款。<笑> OK， you can see there is a the red button， and here it shows successful。OK， so right now it's finished。